All right, number five. Got four minutes, cool. I was a little worried about the timing, but I think we're doing good. <laughs> they outsource before they're ready. If there's one thing you get out of this presentation, one thing, it's to stop outsourcing your marketing. That sounds crazy, but hear me out here. If you actually take that checklist that I just talked about, and you do it, it's gonna take 10 to 20 hours per week to consistently do all the things. That's 40 to 80 hours a month. There is not a marketing agency on the planet that's gonna spend that much time on your business, I guarantee it. But that's only a part-time person in-house, right? Here's another way to frame it. Do you have any managed clients that you spend 40 to 80 hours a month on? Any of them? Probably not, because <laughs> I'm an MSV and I, we definitely don't do that. So we can't assume that we can pay some company two to $4,000 and they're gonna dedicate that type of time to us because it wouldn't be profitable. So you get that part-time person, they're managing your marketing, right? They may not be doing the graphic design, they may not be doing the SEO, they may not be doing some of these facets you need to be doing, but they're managing it for you. So that's how you can offload some of your marketing without just hiring some, some marketing company that's not gonna care about your business like you are. Because we tried outsourcing, we tried hiring salespeople, none of it worked because we didn't have a good marketing foundation to bring leads to the salespeople, and we just said, oh, it doesn't work in the space. But that's not true. All right, moving on. 